In this lesson, we are going to learn two important terms often used in exam questions, uniform velocity and uniform acceleration. Many exam questions use these two terms to provide us with important information required to solve the question, so you must know them. When an object's velocity is not increasing or decreasing, we say its velocity is uniform. So when a question mentions uniform velocity, straight away you must know that acceleration is equal to zero. So when an object's velocity is non-uniform, the velocity changes over time. The object is either accelerating, that is with increasing speed, or decelerating with decreasing speed. Deceleration is also known as retardation or negative acceleration. By definition, acceleration is defined as the change in velocity with time. Acceleration can be computed by taking the final velocity minus the initial velocity and divide by the time duration. If an object increases its speed equally at every equal time interval, it is having uniform acceleration. Here's the illustration. The car starts from rest and after one second, its velocity reached 2 meters per second. It continues to increase its velocity by 2 meters per second with every second. Using the formula of acceleration, we can compute its acceleration at each time interval. Hence, at time t equals to 1 second, the final velocity is 2 meters per second, with its initial velocity equals 0. With that, we compute the acceleration to be 2 meters per square second. Similarly, from time t equals to 1 second to time t equals to 2 seconds, the final velocity is now 4 meters per second and the initial velocity is 2 meters per second. So again, the acceleration works out to be 2 meters per square second. In the same way, we can compute the acceleration from time t equals to 2 seconds to time t equals to 3 seconds and get the acceleration to be 2 meters per square second. Therefore, we say that the car is accelerating uniformly throughout this entire journey at 2 meters per square second. When the increase or decrease in speed over equal time interval is constant, we say the acceleration or deceleration is uniform. But if the increase or decrease in speed over equal time interval is not constant, we say that the acceleration or deceleration is non-uniform. If you find this video useful, do give a like to this video and subscribe or follow us. Visit our website for more free physics videos and try out the self-assessment questions to reinforce your understanding.